um, which of the following neurotransmitter abnormalities is most likely associated with this patient's condition? A seven-year-old boy is brought to the psychologist by his parents who report that their son is, becomes inconsolable when they drop him off at school. The boy is, has difficulty concentrating and has recurrent nightmares about being separated from his parents. These symptoms have persisted for eight months and are affecting his academic performance. So pediatric patient, um, he seems to have some form of like separation anxiety. So I would associate that with like a hormone that is stimulatory. Um, right. So I would probably narrow that down to, well, let's look. So increased norepinephrine, increased dopamine, decreased serotonin. So decreased serotonin, I would more so associate with things like depression. Okay. Uh, same thing probably with like dopamine. So I would narrow it down to like the last two choices at least. Okay. Uh, and then going from there, I would pick uh, increased norepinephrine. Final answer? Yes. Okay, this question is kind of tough because I, I don't even remember this, right? So this is separation anxiety, right? Mm -hmm. um, separation anxiety disorder. Serotonin is a neurotransmitter to play section in mood regulation and decreased signs have been associated with anxiety disorders including separation. So this is kind of one of the ones that, you know, you have to, I, I figure that you know the diagnosis, correct? Yes. So it's kind of one of the things that you have to pick an answer, you learn from it, right? And kind of add to your repertoire of that diagnosis, which is anxiety and separation anxiety. You know that it's decreased serotonin. Um, did I personally know that? No, right? Um, but let's go through the rest of them because it's important. Decreased dopamine, right? Parkinson's, you got to know that. Decreased norepinephrine, um, not typically associated, but you know, um, involved with regulation of attention, alertness, and fight or flight response. Um, so maybe like ADHD, right? Increase uh, dopamine, right? Conditions such as schizo and mania. So that's not it, right? Because that makes sense, right? Um, they're opposite of each other, psychosis and Parkinson's usually. And then increase uh, norepi is fight or flight response in acute situations, but not linked to separation anxiety. But yeah, okay. Hold on. Yeah, give me a second. I, I want to see if I remember anything else. Um, what is separation anxiety? Um, never mind. I was just thinking out loud. Never mind. Okay, perfect. And you can think of SSRIs, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So something you can think about. 